Ahmadu Buhari has said that the fallen heroes of the Nigerian military have shown unalloyed commitment to the common goods of all Nigerians. President Muhammad Buhari stated this in his address at the funeral ceremony of the slain army commander, Lieutenant Colonel Muhammad Abu Ali, and his six other colleagues. The president, who was represented by his chief of staff, Abakari, said words can do no justice to the patriotism and courage of these soldiers who let down their lives for Nigeria. The president said that the gallantry and high sense of professionalism displayed by these gentlemen has contributed to the restoration of peace and normalcy in the Northeast and Nigeria as a whole. Your outstanding efforts are securing the territorial integrity of the country. Undeniably, the gallantry and high sense of professionalism displayed by these gentlemen have contributed to the restoration of peace or normalcy in the Northeast. The President therefore commended the efforts of the leadership of the armed forces and as well as other services and all Nigerians towards the successful end of the insurgency as well as other security threats in the country. The efforts of the leadership of our armed forces as well as our security agencies and the support of all Nigerians towards the successful end of insurgency and other security threats in the country is commendable. Chief of Army Staff Lieutenant General Teko Borate, in an emotional, loud voice, said the slain officers, through fearless and dogged determination to defend the territorial integrity of their fatherland, turned the tide of battle to liberate Nigeria from the scourge of terrorism. And the territorial integrity of our fatherland, this turned the tide of battle. To liberate Nigeria from the scourge of terrorism as members of 119 Force Battalion and the Armed Forces Special Forces. Boratai, who described the late Lieutenant Colonel Abu Ali as Serkin Yaki, meaning the frontline general, said the soldiers would always be remembered. He assured families of the slain soldiers of strong support from the Nigerian military. The last and last respect was given to the fallen heroes. National President of Command Secondary School Old Boys Association, Jaws, Victor Ohai, said Abu's death was a great loss to the nation. We felt proud because we were planning to celebrate the 40th anniversary uh, of the school and it was one of those we were going to, you know, honor. And then only for us to hear a news that he had passed on and it was a devastating. Head of Vigilante in the Northeast alleged that there are saboteurs in the military. System. There are people that are actually supporting the cause of this book. And so it's, it's a very complex fight. And um, it is uh, very unfortunate, even from my own side of the organization. In Abuja, Godwin Amundi, Liberty News.